The financial world is buzzing with discussions surrounding Palantir Technologies and why their ingenious strategy could pay off in a big way. Have you ever watched a webcast or promotional video unveiling a new technology and walked away with more questions than answers? It's a situation many of us have encountered. The most pressing question that often lingers is how can this groundbreaking innovation be applied to my company? Explaining this in a general demo, especially when dealing with complex artificial intelligence software, can be a daunting task. Palantir Technologies has devised a brilliant solution to this quandary. The company's latest software offering is its artificial intelligence platform, also known as AIP. Here's the high-level overview. AIP seamlessly immerses itself into a company's existing systems, consolidating data that was previously siloed across multiple platforms into a unified repository. Next, the software creates a comprehensive model of the organization's business functions. This powerful tool allows customers to leverage large language models to explore processes, examine potential actions, and ultimately make better, more informed decisions. Palantir provides two illuminating examples to illustrate the platform's versatility. Envision an army unit deployed in the field near hostile territory. The commanding officer notes that the enemy is amassing weapons nearby, posing a significant threat. Utilizing AIP, the commander can model various scenarios, predict likely enemy formations, and assess the available assets to effectively repel an attack. Attack. Next, let's consider a private sector company with a warehouse located in the path of a hurricane. The logistics department can leverage AIP to model the impact of a potential warehouse shutdown and identify the most cost-effective alternative sites for ensuring customers receive their orders without disruption. Palantir's strategy for bringing this complex software to the market is through what it calls boot camps. Unlike traditional demo videos, these five-day intensive workshops allow potential customers to get hands-on experience and solve problems specific to their companies. This immersive approach is clearly a more effective way to introduce a product as transformative as AIP. Palantir has completed boot camps with an impressive 915 organizations since mid-2023. This innovative sales strategy has already yielded tangible results, with the company closing 100 136 deals in the first quarter of 2024 alone. Additionally, its U.S. commercial customer count grew a remarkable 69% year-over-year in the same quarter. Sales increased 21% year-over-year to $634 million, a slight acceleration over the 20% growth posted in quarter 4 of 2023. More importantly, customer counts continue to expand rapidly, as depicted in the charts below. Growing the customer base is critical for Palantir, as its revenue model is recurring, meaning customers pay for the software annually. Once Palantir gains a customer, it can reap the rewards for years to come. Palantir was often criticized for its lack of profitability after going public in 2020, but those days are firmly behind it. The company reported its sixth straight quarter of generally accepted accounting principles, net income, and fifth straight quarter of operating income. It also generates substantial free cash flow. As illustrated below, operating income and FCF are ramping up significantly. Palantir wisely utilized its profits and a positive cash flow to build a fortress-like balance sheet, boasting $4.4 billion in current assets versus just $751 million in current liabilities and no long-term debt. Responsible cash management also provided $43 million in interest income in quarter one, a 7% bonus on top of its $634 million in operating revenue. The most significant risk for Palantir shareholders is the company's valuation. The stock trades at 20 times sales. While this is less than fellow high-growth software as a service company, CrowdStrike at 25 times sales, and similar to Datadog at 19 times sales, it is not considered cheap. Investors are understandably enthusiastic about companies operating in the burgeoning artificial intelligence space, but there is always the potential for a pullback in valuations. Because of this, dollar cost averaging is a terrific risk mitigation buying strategy as it involves investing a set amount at recurring intervals rather than lump sum purchases. With its unique sales strategy, positive customer growth trends, and excellent financials, Palantir appears well-positioned to emerge as a long-term winner in the software and artificial intelligence domains. This article clearly highlighted Palantir's innovative approach to introducing its artificial intelligence platform to potential customers through immersive bootcamp workshops. This strategy has already yielded impressive results, with the company closing a significant number of deals and experiencing rapid growth in its commercial customer base. 
Despite facing criticism for a lack of profitability in the past, Palantir has turned a corner, reporting consecutive quarters of net income and operating income under generally accepted accounting principles. The company has also generated substantial free cash flow, which it has wisely used to build a robust balance sheet with minimal debt. While Palantir's valuation is premium compared to some peers, it trades at a reasonable forward price-to-earnings growth ratio. Investors are optimistic about the company's prospects in the artificial intelligence space, but a degree of caution is warranted given the potential for valuation pullbacks in high-growth sectors. Overall, with its innovative product, effective sales strategy, strong financials, and a promising growth trajectory, Palantir appears well-positioned to capitalize on the AI boom and deliver long-term returns for its shareholders.